Hello, Cambridge students and staff. Today is 2J, February 13th. Thank you for tuning in to your Dolphin Daily News. My name is Azil. And my name is Damari. A reminder that the Student Council Character Club and NJHS meeting this afternoon at the Waterford Assisted Living Center at 4.30 to distribute Valentine's Day cards for the residents. Also, there will be a junior and senior anime meeting tomorrow after school. Science Fair winners. Last week, 26 Cafe Dolphins went to compete at the Coastal Bend Regional Science Fair. The following students won awards. Benjamin Hernandez won the United States Air Force Academy STEM Award for his project on black algae. Luke Lamb placed third in Stockingham Water Prize. Isaiah Hinojosa placed third in Behavioral and Social Science for his project titled Reaction Time versus Visual Simulation. Emma Hutchins placed third in biomedical and health sciences for her project on the effects of training on reaction time. Ezra Chavez placed third in biomedical engineering for his project on robotic hands. And con and compact compactional biology and biophionics. Carrie Spence Kyrie Spencer placed second with her project titled A Musical Mind and Heart, and Cassidy Maloney placed first with her project Ener Energy Drink Drama. Luke Lamb placed first in Earth and Environmental Science with his project on tap water in Corpus Christi. In Embedded Systems, Lucas Siscronas Sin placed first with his project titled Blocking Wi-Fi. In Mathematics, Ryan Rocha placed first with his project titled Mathematical Model, How Color Affects Temperature. In Microbiology, Ava Ford and Savannah Fru placed second with a project on Clorox wipes versus other types of cleaning wipes. In Plant Science, Isalane Prasad placed third with her project on seeds germinating in different liquids. In system software, Cedar Culver placed third with his project on different ways to make an action repeat and scratch. In translational medicine, Olive Hansen placed second with her project on heart rate recovery time in adolescence, and Lauren Aguilar placed first with her project on teen stress. Emma Hutchins, Isaiah Hinojosa, Lucas Sinros, Luke Lamb, Cassidy Maloney, Ryan Rocha, Lauren Aguilar, Kyrie Spencer, Olive Hansen, Ava Ford, and Savannah Friel have advanced to the State Fair and College Station March 22nd through 23rd. Cassidy Maloney, Luke Lamb, Lucas Sinjeros, Lauren Aguilar, and Ryan Rocha advanced to the National Middle School Science Fair. Thermo Fisher Award. Lauren Aguilar and Cassidy Maloney won Port of Corpus Christi and Future Problem Solver Award. Luke Lamb's project, Chlorine and pH Level Equality in Corpus Christi, Texas Tap Water, took the top award in the junior division. On Saturday, Deep Space Dolphins completed in the semi-area first championship. They tied for the highest scoring round. Deep Space Dolphin was one of three middle schools. They ended the competition mid-pack. Way to go, Deep Space Dolphins. Our next competition will be in May. If you are interested in robotics and are in the 7th or 8th grade, come to the club meeting after school. Today is the last day to buy carnations from our amazing Cafe PTA. The cost is $2 and can be purchased before and after school by the Black Gates. Let's support our fabulous PTA delivery. will be during 7th period on Valentine's Day. Also, think you have what it takes to make waves in the swimming arena? You just might be the athlete we are looking for. Swim team meeting for 7th and 8th grade only on February 20th at 5.30 in the cafeteria. Hope to see you there. PTA is selling the yearbook once again. The price of the yearbook will be $40 until March 22nd, 27th, 2024. Anybody needing additional information can contact PTA at Kathy PTA one nine eight eight at gmail dot com. Copies of forms will be available for parents in the front office with Miss Cardenas, our secretary. Thank you.
Upcoming events, Family Literacy Night and Veterans Memorial on February 22nd from 5 to 7 p.m. Performances by Colden, Morellas, and Faye Webb, Kathy, Drone, Robotics, Cheer, NJHS, and Student Council will be there as well. There will be book giveaways, crafts, entertainment, and so much more. Hope to see you there. Teen Book Fest by the Bay will be from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. on February 24th at the Education Service Center at 209 North Water Street. There will be over 20 authors and illustrators, a book swap, and food concessions. You can visit authors and purchase books as well as attend writing and illustrating workshops. It is free admission and free parking. If you are a member of 6th grade robotics, co-drone, and TAME, and or 7th and 8th grade robotics, please come to see Dr. Hopkins for a photo pass. Club photos will be on Friday, February 16th. You must have a pass to be released from class for club photos. Student council members, pick up your picture pass from Mr. Avalar in room 113 before Friday. You are welcome to come by before school or after school and, and other club members Please see your sponsor for a pass to take club pictures. Today is Fat Tuesday, the last day of Carnival and the day before Ash Wednesday. Fat Tuesday is the interwinding of a period of festivals and feasts that lead to a time of fasting and reflection, also known as Shrove Tuesday and Mardi Gras. The enduring celebration has many traditions and deep roots around the world. In the United Kingdom, Shrove Tuesday is also known as Pancake Day. Pancakes are the perfect menu item when the future includes abstaining from fats, eggs, and sweets. Until next time, let's make it a great cafe day. Go, Go Dolphins! Dolphins.